Cheers, people. It is Friday night, and I want to just try to hit you up, hit you up and talk about some music because I got a bunch of music to talk about, and I'm getting kind of backed up, and I want to share it with you. First up is um, some new progressive rock that I'm excited to share with you. Well, two of them. Um, the first one we'll start with is Stop Motion Orchestra. I'm really uh, embarrassed to say that they sent me their first CD. I don't remember reviewing it, but I think I did. I tried to find it. I know I have it here somewhere. I'm embarrassed. Lightworks is a brand new CD recording by this modern chamber rock progressive rock band they have they're, they're coming at it to my ears from the same approach as the classic amazing canterbury progressive english rock band henry cow the music is very intelligent it's a lot of movement melody and interplay the cats can play. I've only listened to this a couple times, so I know there are nuances and things about, excuse me, specific things that I will, that you will notice after several listings that I can't tell you about because they haven't come through yet. But I can enthuse very honestly right away about this music and this CD, Lightworks, and I thank the band for sending it to me. The word intelligent comes to mind, and again, contemporary and chamber comes to me because of the interplay. There's sax, there's cello, as well as the the regular um, rhythm section instruments. And the people play well together. And um, one way I could describe them is that they kind of hit, they sound, their writing in part sounds like they're hitting sweet spots of Henry Cow. And what I mean by that is Henry Cow, um, I love this album in Praise of Learning. This is an absolute classic album if you've never heard it. But they would improvise and they would do things that are soundscapes and then things that are, then they would go into some really beautiful melodic passages. Stop Motion Orchestra really seems to have focused on those beautiful passages and right from that as a standpoint, I re highly recommend this. Stop Motion Orchestra Lightworks. Um, wouldn't be surprised if this ends up on my um, one of the albums of the year list. Lightworks by Stop Motion Orchestra. And again, I'll make the connection to some records in my collection. Henry Cow, Fred Frith, who figures in somewhat indirectly with all this indirectly fits in, figures into the next release that I'm going to, um, just came out that I'm really excited about. The new Mana Mirage. I've talked about the Muffins. The American contingent of Canterbury. Soft Machine, Egg, Hatfield in the North, Henry Cow, the Muffins back in the 70s first American band to catch that vibe and capture that flavor authentically. I remember, and I'll say this again because I truly have been a fan of this band since the 70s, so I'm, it's a bucket list to actually be on one of their records, okay? But I remember reading about the Muffins in the indie music press, and what I read let me know I need to hear this. So as soon as I could order it, because I had to order it from Random random Radar Records, I was it was exactly what I was looking for. There's a passage on here that is along with the Henry Cow. It's one of those sweet spots. It's like I've actually made a, a loop in my uh, archives of personal just messing around records of recordings where I've made a loop of this particular thing, and I just loop it. It's so sweet. I want to hear it several times. The new one, Mana Mirage, Rest of the World, Dave Newhouse, Wynn Woodruff, keyboard, key, keyboard player, writer of the Muffins, friend of mine. This is the new one. 
This is really good, and I'm so stoked to be. I, I, I play bass on one track on this. It comes with a card. Again, very distinctly designed by Gonzalo Fuentes Riquelm, the man responsible for the Frets of Yore project that I'm also on and includes Fred Frith, among others, from Henry Cow. Again, I bring this band up so much because they are, along with the Muffins, very important to me. Kind of like Pink Floyd and Black Sabbath and Led Zeppelin are to people. These are my Black Sabbath, Led Zeppelin's, Pink Floyd's, Henry Cow, the Muffins, Slap Happy Henry Cow. Also, I'm jazzed that Guy Sagers, who's a friend of mine, we haven't met yet, but from Belgium, from the amazing band Universe Zero, he's also on the new Mana Mirage album. I'm not on the same track, but I'm on the same record with him. That means a lot to me. Amazing band, Universe Zero. This record, um, this is, it's a, it's a, it's a major new release regarding progressive rock music internationally. The people on here, you know, Dave Newhouse, Sean Rickman on drums, he's on the track I'm on. Mark Stanley, I've been talking about Mark. He just put, both Mark and Carla, they just put out this uh, collaborative CD, Double Dreaming. Mark Stanley and Carla Duratz are on here. Billy Swan from The Muffins is on here. Jerry and Michelle King, Jerry King, um, Cloud Over Jupiter. Greg Siegel, Forrest Fang, someone whose music I don't have in, in the collection, but I've been listening to on the radio, Hearts of Space for years, and we're friendly on, on, in, on the internet now. He's on here. This is amazing to be on, and not just to be on, but it's really good. I'll play a little bit before I go. Billy, Bret Hart is on here. It's just an all-star cast, and it's, it's really good. I'm going to go ahead and the song that I play is dedicated to uh, Gonzalo, the artist. And this is it. Thank you so much, Dave, for asking me to participate in this album. It truly is a bucket list accomplishment for me. It means a lot to me, personally. I love this music. I've been loving this music since I first discovered it. And I'm playing on this track. This means so much to me. You can hear pretty soon. There's Dave blowing. I really am a fan, and that's why this, I don't mind if I come off geek style. I really don't mind if anyone watching <laughs> is laughing at me, you know, or making fun of me. I know that some people do. <laughs> they watch me, I don't know, and that's what they do. Shame on you, because it don't mean a damn thing to me. This means the world to me. Another Universe Zero, Crawling Wind. I'm on a record with Guy, you know. Guy is a friend of mine. We were just messaging earlier on 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 um, the internet about this this means so much to me universe zero some of the finest progressive rock musicians and records in the world and I'm playing with these guys yeah okay I'm done have you had enough <laughs> I can laugh at myself but I'm also enjoying it too. Thank you, Dave. I know you'll see this. Thank you, Dave. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, Carla. Thank you, Mark. Hey, thank you all. Thank you, Gonzalo. I'm gonna stop there. I could be talking about a whole lot of stuff, but I wanted to focus on the uh, positive aspect of communication and music and just again put out a message of I'm perplexed as to why we're in a time of such negative and 
people with their heads on fire and seemingly like, seemingly like there's this narrative being played out that is driving civility to the brink and a big part of it from my perspective it has to do with um, capitalism run amok everything being politicized to the point of hysteria and it just seems to be because there this is again the way it looks to me because there's a segment of the world that is benefiting from all this chaos it's just being pushed 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 further 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 every day the news is just crazy 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 and people crazily trying to excuse it and say things like it's not so bad or wait you'll wait and see there you wait and see brothers and sisters I am not waiting and seeing I've been watching all my life and it's just history repeating itself okay I, I'm I I'm not the one being a dumbass hanging on to foolish denial I'm just looking at it and saying here we go again stuck on fucking stupid so thank goodness for music. Thank goodness for music. Something else I was listening to was some Akiko Yano. Gohanga Dekitayo. I love this woman from, from, from Japan. Used to be married to Ryuichi Sakamoto. Oh, she makes some of the best music. Okay, I'm going to go out with some Mana Mirage. <laughs> <laughs> 